Hello. I'm here to share with you some info on step-by-step -step guide to offline marketing riches. One day, a woman walks up to a counter to buy a pretzel and asks the young lady how she was doing. The young lady playfully responded, blah. Another day, another 43 cents. From there, they went on to laugh about the amount of money that they simply weren't making at their jobs. A young woman who'd been on the heels of the woman who'd approached the counter first interjected gracefully saying, Hey, if you ladies want to learn how to make some money, I'd be willing to help. There are thousands of affiliate programs that work well on an automated system, but every now and again a program comes along and it would be wise to have an offline marketing strategy that is as diligent as the research you do finding keywords to place your PPC advertisements. The affiliate programs that work best with offline marketing techniques are the ones that you genuinely believe in. As long as you are an affiliate of a program that you believe in these three offline marketing tips will guarantee you some real good leads for your business. The people you see. If you sell or promote products that you actually use your own self products or dreams that you have bought into your own self, then three quarters of what it takes to sell or promote that product is already taken care of. Once you believe in something or once you are using something that is enhancing the quality of your life, it is very easy to share your experiences and expertise with others. You'll be sharing your experience with others whether they are prospects or not out of your passion for what you are doing. Tabbed Flyers Believe it or not, tabbed flyers still work. You can post these in laundromats, on campuses, in coffee shops, in hair salons, anywhere you can with respect to the business establishment where the flyers will be located. In this instance, it's best to sell your own self too. Business Cards Business cards are an integral part of offline marketing. As a suggestion, try to consider having two sets of business cards. A set that is very polished and professional and one that was made for free or at an extremely low cost. You could even drop it on the floor. Do not worry about being a little bug, someone will pick it up, especially if it is flashy or gaudy. You just never know. Thanks for watching. Please click my link in description for more information. Bye.